this week's episode of Trinity Prep TV. My name is David. And my name is Anna, and we've got a lot in store for you today. We'll be talking to Saints about their New Year's predictions, and we'll be taking a deep dive into a specific Trinity Prep artist. You can look forward to all that and more on today's broadcast, starting with the Man on the Street segment. Happy New Year, everyone. My name is David, and today I'll be interviewing Trinity Prep students about what 2024 has in store for them. Stay tuned. What are your predictions for 2024? Gonna be president. I predict AI is going to take over. Aliens will come to the States. An AI recording artist. The Jets are going to make the playoffs for the first time in 14 years. The Ravens will win the Super Bowl. 49ers are going to win. Ayush will attempt a backflip. Ayush, is this true? No. <laughs> no. They're already here, but they're just like blending in. He could be one right now. Are you an alien? Maybe. Maybe. He's definitely an alien. Yo, are you an alien? Out of this world, man. <laughs> yes, I am. This is the year that Jose is going to get a significant up. <laughs> Into that. <laughs> what are your resolutions for this year? I want to gain a lot of pounds. Going to the gym with Jose. Less than five detentions this semester. Go to the gym more. To do better in school and to be more organized. To get better grades. Do all my homework two days before. Go to the gym and meet new people, you know? Life's a journey. I'm, I'm just hoping that I can, me and my family and everyone in the Trinity Prep community can stay healthy and happy. As you can see, there's a lot to look forward to this year. Be on the lookout for new Trinity Prep broadcast episodes coming soon. Thank you. Have you ever wondered how a simple lump of clay can turn into an amazing piece of art? Today, we meet with Sophia Taylor, AP 3D art student, as we explore her passion for pottery and her amazing work. I'm Sophia Taylor, and I'm in 12th grade. I'm a senior. I'm currently in AP 3D art. I decided to take this class because I've been doing pottery for like three years beforehand, and I kind of just wanted a challenge, and I also wanted to like make things that I wanted to make. So basically, like, we choose our, like, investigation question, and then we spend the entire year making pieces that go into that question. This, I actually changed it a lot of times, but as of right now, I'm doing sort of um, how can nature contrast, like, organic elements and then, like, man-made, like, perfect elements. I would definitely recommend it. It's a lot of fun. Um, and the biggest piece of advice I would say is that take it if you're, like, enjoy pottery and that's something that you're passionate about mm -hmm. because it's definitely hard to stay motivated if you don't enjoy what you're doing. That's all for today's episode. Make sure to look out for new broadcast episodes and the February issue coming out soon. Thank you.